we're going to use the boundedness theorem to show that this polynomial has no real zero less than negative two. So the number we were given is negative two. Uh, when we're given a number that's less than zero, what we're looking for in synthetic division is that all the numbers in the bottom row alternate in sign. When that happens, it means that this function has no zero less than negative two. So let's go ahead and start the division process. We're going to have a negative 2 outside as our divisor. Let's check to make sure we're not missing any degrees. Degree 4, degree 3, degree 2. Uh, looks like we're missing degree 1, so let's go ahead and insert a 0 there as its coefficient. We're going to start the process by bringing down the first term of 1. Multiply that with negative 2 to get negative 2. Bring down negative 1. Multiply that with negative 2 to get 2. Bring down 1, multiply that with negative 2 to get negative 2. Bring down negative 2, multiply that with negative 2 to get 4. Bring down 7. If we take a look at the bottom row, you have positive, negative, positive, negative, positive. So they alternate in sign, and that means that this polynomial has no real zero less than negative two, and negative two is our lower bound. 